Hey, it's Denise here from luckybitch.com and today we are talking about a very cool topic and it's something that I'm super passionate about and I say that about every topic. <laughs> it's when you should stop bartering. Now, if you don't know what bartering is, it means exchanging your goods or services for somebody else's goods or services without money ever changing hands. And I believe this is a hugely detrimental thing for female business owners to do. And I'm going to tell you why in the rest of this video. Now at the start of your business, bartering seems like an amazing idea and most of us do it. Now I remember at the very, very start of my business, it was maybe six months in and I knew that I needed some good website photos because the ones that I had taken, and I'll try and dig it out for you, I was in my mum's backyard, I had a Nokia phone, it wasn't even a smartphone back then and I took a picture of myself like this and it was super, super dodgy. So I knew that I had to upgrade and buy some photos but I couldn't afford it or I wasn't willing to spend the money. So I found a local photographer and I said that I would create her a website if she did me some photos. It seemed like a great idea, but I don't really know how to do websites. It's not my zone of genius. It's <laughs> not something I'm really good at. And even though it kind of worked out at the time, there comes a point in your business where you really have to stop the bartering arrangement. Now, I understand it feels like it's convenient, it feels like it's warm and fuzzy, like, oh, what a great concept, you know, no money has to change hands, it's just an, an energetic economy, and that's all well and good, but if you aspire to have a thriving business, if you aspire to make money in your business and make this your career, not just a hobby or just a little bit of money on the side, then bartering can really stop the flow of money into your business. It is a highly symbolic thing to accept money for what you do and to pay out other people in return. Um, you know, just sending out that message to the universe is, you know, I, I just do it for free. I do it for energetic exchange. It really can set you up to never really accepting money into your business. Plus, have you noticed that when you've done bartering arrangements before, and I would love to hear from you in the comments on this one, where it's not always quite equal. Sometimes it's something you didn't really want anyway, or sometimes you feel like you're giving more than you're receiving. And it really is energetically messy to barter instead of accepting and, and paying out money for what you do. It's much, much cleaner. And I, I heard from someone once, you know, they said, oh, well, it's just easier if we're buying each other's stuff anyway. You know, no money has to exchange hands. It's just easier. And I did this myself. I remember um, one of my coaching clients, I owed her affiliate money. And so instead of her paying me one of her, uh, her coaching installments, I just took it off her affiliate fees. And that was really messy about a year down the track when we were doing an audit of my affiliate payments. And I had to remember the fact that we had done that, you know, and we'd I, we'd sent maybe one email about it, but it was just really energetically messy for my accounting and for her accounting as well. And I'm going to quote one of my money mentors here, Kendall Summerhawk, who I absolutely love. And she said, it should never be inconvenient to trade money. And it's so true. So if something is worth paying for and you do want to have an energetic butter arrangement, well, just pay each other. It doesn't matter if it's the exact same amount, just pay each other so you're respecting each other's work. Now, when you draw a line in the sand and you stop bartering, really amazing things are going to happen. First of all, you are going to get a test and this happens every single time. And I talk about this in my money blocks audio as well, which is at luckybitch.com slash blocks. I talk about this one a lot where if you say, I'm not going to barter anymore within the next 24 hours, somebody will send you a message and say, Hey, I'd love to do your course. Would you like to do my course in exchange? It's going to happen. I trust me. It absolutely will. And the thing is, Learning to say no and making that powerful line in the sand is going to be a symbolic rite of passage for you in your business. It will open up so many avenues for you to receive actual money. And trust me, it absolutely will happen. So what do you actually say to people when they want to barter with you? Now, it's really easy just to say no. 
Because remember, no is a complete sentence. And you will find that when you get better and better at saying no, and there are you know, other ways you can say it for sure, but you will find that nobody will ask you anymore. After a certain amount of time of you saying no, it's just like a little test from the universe to say, are you sure? Are you sure you actually want to receive money in your business? Are you sure? And if you just keep on saying no, nobody will ask you again. And it's been years and years since anybody asked me to do a barter arrangement with them because I'm not energetically aligned to bartering anymore. I'm energetically aligned to receiving money and being happy to pay other people's prices as well. So if you want a little bit more insight into this and why it's such a big money block for women, then listen to my free audio class at luckybitch.com slash blocks. I talk about bartering. I talk a little bit more about what you should say when somebody asks you to barter. And also I talk about six other money blocks that you might want to start working on as well. So you can take your income to the next level. So you can create your first class life. It's your time and you're ready for the next step. So stop bartering today. Draw a line in the sand. Are you with me? Good. (laughs) It's your time and you're ready for the next step. Bye. Hey, gorgeous lucky bee. Thanks for watching my video today. But if you need more Denise in your life and who doesn't, then don't worry. I've got something extra special for you. I've just created a brand new Money Blocks workshop just for female entrepreneurs who wanna work on their money mindset because I've identified seven main ways that entrepreneurs like you are blocking your income every day. Things like bartering, undercharging, and struggling with setting money boundaries. So you can sign up for this totally free money workshop at luckybitch.com slash blocks and start unlocking everything holding you back from making money and creating the life of your dreams. Now there's no fluff, just practical Virgo solutions and advice so you can clear those seven pesky money blocks. You deserve to make great money in your business and there has never been a better time like today to start clearing your money blocks. So sign up at luckybitch.com slash blocks and start your clearing today.